Harding Lovner was founded in 1989 by Dan Harding and David Lovner. I joined in early 1991. Our goal was to uh, establish a high quality investment firm offering our services to US institutions. Since then, we've uh, stuck with our underlying investment philosophy, but uh, expanded our range of products to a global client base. We buy stocks of companies that are of high quality in the way that we define it, and that are growing. And I emphasize growing companies rather than growth stocks. So we are quality growth investors who pay attention to prices. Our process is uh, very straightforward. Um, if I can go uh, even higher level than the process itself, what I'd say is that it's uh, designed to be repeatable by uh, the next generation of investment professionals and by new investment professionals who join us. So the characteristics of the process are that it's highly structured and highly disciplined in its execution. The process itself is uh, straightforward qualification, research, valuation, portfolio construction, risk management process. At one level, we're differentiated by our results. We're, by sticking to this uh, investment philosophy of focusing exclusively on high-quality growth companies, we've outperformed over the 26 years that we've been in existence, which uh, over that lifetime makes a significant difference in outcomes to our clients. Our investment team has grown considerably over the years, but uh, has been remarkably stable. We've lost very few analysts or portfolio managers, and indeed the senior portfolio managers on our long-standing strategies, emerging markets, global equity, and international equity, have all been with us for nearly 20 years each. We have today about 34 investment professionals, including our traders. We have uh, teams of portfolio managers on all our strategies. We like to talk about how we have this experienced investment team, but it's important for them to collaborate, but we don't do so in pursuit of consensus. We like to talk about collaboration without consensus. Internally, I think we're characterized by a very strong investment culture, and that investment culture is itself defined partly by the structured and disciplined nature of our investment process, by our transparency, and by individual accountability. Mm -hmm.